Is that it? All right, let's just play. New game. Hard mode? No, let's go normal. <laughs> okay. I don't know how much I'll play this. We'll just see. Maybe like an hour. Maybe like an hour and a half. I don't know. We'll see how the game goes. So yeah, it does have a dub, so that's interesting. And guess who the voice, the main character? You'll recognize the main character's voice. It's awesome. I don't know about anybody else, though. I'll probably recognize everybody at this point. Oh, so. Oh, what number is that rise in this series? Uh, 16 or 17? I think. There's like, no, wait, maybe even more than that. No, I think it's game number 20. Because there's, after this is like the Roar Noir series. There's three games of the Dusk trilogy. And then you have the Roar, Roar Noir series, which is three more there. So it rises the 20th? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know, there's a lot. This series has been going on since PlayStation 1 days, so. I thought that perhaps this place, but the decay is the same. Oh my god. I know that voice actor. Who is that? It could still be possible. Oh my god. Oh my god, who is that Rosha? Oh my god, that's gonna bug me. I know I know him. Who is that? Shit. Have you traveled here from afar? It's Bryce Prappet bro <laughs> He's in everything! Are you kidding me? This kid here is Bryce. This is amazing. Why is he in every single freaking game? Yes. So you can tell. Oh, I know this guy's. I knew it. There are some Western peculiarities about the way you talk. I, all I hear is Kirito every time he talks. I see. So the thing is, back in the then. day, back in the day, he used to be in so many anime games. So many. That's what his. That's how he started. <laughs> A little. I go there to trade too. Welcome to this barren frontier land. He just uses his Makoto slash Kirito voice in every barren game. Frontier land. That's not true. This place is plentiful. True. For the last few years, the weather's been calm and gentle. But some of the town's water veins have dried up, making it really tough to fill all my orders of grain. The soil's becoming less and less fertile every day. That's why I've been running around so much on deliveries. I thought I know. I thought he was in this game because I watched the trailer for this game and I heard his voice. I thought it's the same voice. It's the same Sorry voice. To That's you awesome. You're so busy with your own business. <laughs> oh no, it's boring to travel alone. So I'm actually glad to have you. It's quite a ways to the next ruin. So please enjoy the ride. Oh my god, it's amazing. See over there? That ruin past the workshop is the one you're looking for. Morgana? My destination is actually that workshop. Oh, um... It's a medicine shop that's run by... Human Morgana, room. okay. Hmm. A workshop in a place like this? So it still does exist in this land. Oh. You can drop me off right here. Huh? But he's oh, a... He, that guy, other guy plays a bad guy somewhere oh my god why why is it it's gonna kill me that's fine i prefer to walk there on my own two feet okay we're gonna look this up really quick while we're playing here i have to know to walk on your own two feet as expected of a scholar i guess scholar is that what i look like oh i'm sorry if i was wrong since you're investigating the ruins <gasps> Oh my god, get ready. I'm not gonna tell you who, just wait till you hear her voice. <laughs> You're not far off, but I am an alchemist. Let's see. An alchemist? <gasps> Richard Epcar voices this guy. He is the, um. Oh my god. It's Ansem! It's freaking Ansem! I knew it! Why didn't I know that? I'm so stupid. That guy is Ansem. Kingdom Hearts 2 Ansem. And <laughs> I didn't realize that. 
Oh my god. An isolated workshop on a remote grassy plain. There, a girl lives all alone. Her name is Aisha. Aisha. Even Aisha. today, she continues to make medicine by herself. Oh. Um, this and that. And mix this powder in to give it a nice fragrance. And... Yup, looks good. When the liquid turns a golden color, then... <laughs> Oops, sorry, Panna. I forgot to give you your breakfast. It's Erica Harlicher, by the way. That was her. <laughs> she said everything. This is like one of her first games, I think. Yeah, it's Yuna. Yuna and Ansem. Hell yeah. Sorry for making you wait. We got... We got more. We got a uh, Morgana. We, we got on, and who does Bryce voice in um? Food and eat slowly. In Persona. It's not healthy to eat so fast. Uh, the sun feels so nice and warm. Maybe I should do the laundry. But before that, I'm hungry too. I've been so busy I forgot to eat. Oof. Mm. This isn't good. You could tell I this is like the beginning of her voice career. It's a little bit It's like way different than what she is now. What should I eat? Or she's just trying to sound young, I guess I don't know. For breakfast, so maybe I better combine it with lunch. Do I have an egg that I can have with the leftover soup from yesterday? <laughs> What's wrong, Panna? I'm thinking about what to eat, so quiet down. Yeah, it doesn't sound like it very much. The only reason I know is I looked it up. Oh, I'm still in the middle of a synthesis. It's a good thing I remembered. Let's see who else is in this game. I need to finish this before lunch. Okay, I'm just gonna combine it with lunch. Uh, Kira Buckland voices somebody in this game. 2B. Uh, we have Ray, Ray Chase is in this game. Wow. And there's Bryce Pappenbrook, yep. Uh... Wendy Lee, she voices song. Johnny Young Bosch is in this game. Yo, that's crazy. Wow. Oh, it's okay. Johnny Young Come freaking in. Bosch. Hell yeah, he's in everything back in the day. This is, like I said, this is, everyone starts like anime games. That's how everyone begins their careers. And then as they get popular, they start to. Oh. Hello, Aisha. Oh, oh this is. Oh, hello, Bernie. Fernie. Ah, it's as smoky and smelly as always, I see. Eating while synthesizing just isn't proper. Hey! Hey, Aisha, do you like boats? Uh, delicious. The medicine you ordered will be ready in a minute. So, please wait just a little longer. Uh, thank you. But it looks like something serious is happening inside the cauldron. Hey, you see that? There's hope inside that cauldron. Are you sure you should be so calm about it? Oh, I'm not. It may not look like it, but I'm seriously about to freak out. If I don't hurry, it'll be too late. Uh, how did you let it come to this? Well, while I was synthesizing, Hannah reminded me to feed her. And as I was preparing straw for her, I noticed how great the weather has been. Then I started wondering if I should do the laundry or eat something first. And then, before I knew it, a lot of smoke was coming out of the cauldron. Ah, uh, now I understand. We need to hurry up and do something. You're right. Um, what was I doing before I gave Panna her food? I dropped in all the necessary ingredients. That's right, the medicine was starting to turn gold. Now, to neutralize it for the next step, I need... Um, where did I put it? Aisha, hurry! I don't think it's supposed to smell like this. It's still okay. This is perfectly normal. I like that. What is that? The goat thing in the background? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna eat one more. Hey, that's ill manner. I mean, no food can taste very good with this odor in the air. Am I right? Well, that's not true. Just a bit more. One more stir 
should do it. Swirl, swirl. There. <laughs> it's done. Wow. All right. There. I finally got all the soot off. You can open your eyes now. <laughs> Thank you. Being covered with soot will spoil your cuteness. Soot, soot. Covered with soot. Jeez. Hey, You're Shane. Saying stuff like that, I start blushing whenever you call me cute. Oh, um, here's the medicine you ordered. One, two, three. Yep, it's all here. Thank you, Aisha. Oh, actually, oh God, I got I really bright. Favor to ask you. <coughs> what? Well, after I put in this order, I got an additional. Order. Oh boy. Can I ask you for one more bottle? No. Sure. If it's just one bottle, it won't take that long either. Is there like a oh, auto? But I might need more like I don't have to keep pushing A. Some games have that. Oh, I can go back. Really? 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 What is? One, 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 two, three. Cheese. Cheese, cheese, cheese. You're always. <laughs> swirl, swirl, swirl. Okay, sorry. I you can actually go back and do everything. Are you serious? I'll I'll stop. I just want. <laughs> What's? <laughs> All right, that's um a thing. Okay, I'm gonna go gather some outside real quick. Oh, you can open this. Oh, we're already going. Jeez, you feel like you're weak in Sky? No, it's just no. As long as you're getting XP, you can level up. Like once you get to like one or two XP, I wouldn't do anymore. Cause there's no point. Cause you're gonna be sitting there forever. <laughs> You can open the system menu for the world map by accessing the diary on the field. Okay. Uh, it says diary, but it says notebook. Is that what that is? You can change the in-game battle music and at your battle game music from the... Oh, really? Okay. In town, you're able to use the rest feature. Rest will cover your HP and MP. If you need to check out what to do next, check the notes from the menu. Okay. Your notes are updated. You'll see a notice like this. When you lose track of what to do, check your notes. We need materials to make medicine. Let's get some from the garden. Okay. Tats may have a set reward and die. Oh god, there it is. Deadline. When the deadline passes, your reward will decrease. So be careful. So I can actually go past the deadline, but still be okay. Okay. Also, the details of the task have clear. All right. Give you artwork from the album within the menu. Initially, all the artwork is hidden and cannot be viewed. Each panel can be unlocked by un accomplishing a mission. If you unlock all panels, you will receive a special bonus. They're giving me all those tutorials up front here. All right. Yay, we can move around. Oh, all right. I, I love the sound effects. I don't know why. You get like three to four but where I am, but when I went to Safari Tower, I was getting like 10 on some monsters. Yeah, I think it just depends on the monsters you're fighting. Like, um, I would... I mean, I don't remember a lot of the first chapter. I just kind of like, I fought enemies along the way I, where I went, I was fine. I don't think I ever fainted once in first chapter, except for maybe very towards the end, there was a boss fight I won't tell you about, but uh, cause I guess spoilers. Uh, there's a boss fight at the end of the game. There's like one boss fight that is relatively hard. Other than that, I had no problems at all. All right, what is the money in this game? There's a hundred of something, I don't know. I love that effect. Okay, we got a flower tree staff. Cotton shirt. No items can be obtained. We got the basket for nothing. Okay. Status. Pursuit, protect, disperse, back in time. There was one thing I really liked about Ryza and that this menu here changed all throughout the game, the more party members you got. I think what it's probably gonna do in this game is just add the party members like to the sides here. I liked how the artwork changed in Ryza. That was really cool. It had like an actual picture of everybody on there. That's really cool. Album, okay. 
damage. You get her to level 5, knock, synthesize a bomb with knockback, defeat 5 different monsters, find a flyer, use battle skills 10 times. Oh boy. <laughs> Buy 500 cold worth of shops items at the shop, fulfill a request 5 times, battle attack 10 times, use Ryzen ointment 5 times. And there are how many pages of this? There are 9 pages of this. Okay. Hey, it's Ernie. Poster, huh? Zoom. Oh my god. Oh, that's just my stuff. Okay. Grandpa's notebook. Oh, I already know how to make stuff. Okay. This isn't my first Atlantic game, but I wonder how the synthesizing system works in this game. I guess... It's kind of weird they just throw you into it, you know? Okay, I'll also go ahead and save. Well, are they gonna let me save? Or wait. Okay, we need materials to make medicine. Let's get some from the garden. Okay. Can I not save here? They said, oh, it's over here? No. Where's it over here? Oh, okay, maybe I just can't save yet. Oh, well, let's just go. Oh, look at that little cute thing. I see flowers. Any glowing spot. Multiple times or hold it down. Oh, you can hold it down too. Time passes as you're gathering. Let go of aid or move away to stop. Also, when it stops glowing, you can't gather. Okay. However, water from the... Okay, water from the well is unlimited. Okay, that's the thing that's stayed the same. 21st... 21st? I knew it was up there. I knew it was like 20th or something. 21st mainline game in the series. Yeah, it started back on the PS1 or even earlier than that, I think. Move your gathering. Okay, yep. The container can store lots of items. Yep. Yeah, Atlier is a... It takes a certain mindset to like it. Um... I played Atlier Sophie, and I liked that. I thought it was okay. I actually beat the game, surprisingly. Um, thought the game was alright. You know, wasn't anything amazing, but I, I kind of enjoyed it. Um, it was a nice time sink. And Rise, I actually just fully enjoyed the, the actual synthesizing. I enjoyed the combat, especially, a lot. Um, the characters, eh. Can I jump? Oh, I can jump. Okay. Alright, uh, just... Okay, uh... Oh. Oh, I have to hold it down? Okay. Well... Mm, I wonder if this is enough. Uh, do you want to know how many chapters there are? Because you're actually almost halfway through the game. <laughs> oh, my, oh, I could just tell you if you want. But I'm not familiar with medicinal herbs or synthesis. In the first game, there's only... Well, the second game has eight chapters. But they're all... They're a lot shorter than the first games. The first games is four chapters. I think. Is there fourth and then a final one, or is it just four? I forget. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm used to this. Now that I have all the necessary ingredients, I'll hurry back and start synthesizing. Hold on. I think it's four chapters. Momo, if Momo over here, he can tell you. Uh, I, 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 it's gonna bug me if I don't look it up now. How many chapters? Oh, there's five chapters in the game. Yeah, five chapters total, including the prologue. Um, towards the end of the game, you should be around level 50 or so. 40 to 50. I think I was... I, the thing is, though, if you carry your, your um, game over from the first, the first chapter to the second chapter, which you can actually do that, I'm guessing you're playing on PC, um, you can transfer your saves over and you get to keep some stuff. Uh, if you don't carry it over, you'll just start at a certain level. I think you start at, like, 50 or 60 in the second game. If, depending on what you do. I don't remember. Memory points. I don't... Well, that was neat. Draw the water. 
Uh, yeah, I'll take 10 waters. Does it make it easier? Um, I actually, I think you get to, I remember you get to keep your weapon. Yeah, you're fine on levels, Shane. Uh, I think you get to keep your the weapons and your armor. I remember I got to keep my weapon when I carried it over. I know that for sure. If you don't get, to, if you don't carry your stuff over, then you just start with a specific weapon, I think. This guy is so... I don't know. This is so plain looking. I just can't help it. I'm not too familiar with the way. <laughs> Alright, let's synthesize. Man, we're just synthesizing right away. It's such a... Now then, please wait until the medicine is ready. I'll start making it right away. Yep. Estelle is the main character for the first game and the second game. The third game... I won't say... We won't say anything. It's, uh, it's gonna be a little bit different. The third game is a l quite a bit different than first and second chapter. Yeah, there's another main. There's a. She's in the third game, but she's not the main character. To synthesize, select the necessary recipe. Okay. Yep. Uh, require specific items or ingredients, specific uh, categories. For any specific categories, you can select any item from that category. Yep. All right. So it plays. It looks like it's kind of similar. Just like your ingredients, choose how many days you want to make. Days will lapse as you synthesize. As days? Oh. Oh no, my battery. Oh my god. My headset's dying. Why? It should last another little, little bit. Once it dies, I'll probably just stop streaming. It's, I hope it, it should last another like 30 minutes or so. I don't know. You can choose to put your synthesized items in your basket or store in your container. When you want to use the container, open the menu in town where you can synthesize. Okay. Uh. Okay. Wait, what am I supposed to be? I'm just supposed to make this. Hold on. Uh, I assume so. Okay. Oh, I have to use all of it. Okay. Is this okay? How many should I use? Um, uh, one. I don't want to use all three. <laughs> Now trust me, when you get done with the first chapter, you'll immediately want to play the second chapter. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, I know, I, I was actually gonna die. I thought it died earlier today and I thought I charged it, but this headset sucks for battery. <laughs> I mean, right now it's probably pretty slow for you, which the first chapter is the slowest Trails game in the whole series. Probably. It's one of those like, it has a really slow burn. <laughs> uh, oh, it's doing something. Dirt power. Moss grass. More dirt powder was duplicated. Whoa. Yay, it's done. To basket to container. Um to basket? Wait, no. Yeah, to basket. It's done. Here you go, Ernie. Yeah, when you get to the Cold Steel series, everything is pretty much a lot of his voice acted. Um, the first and second game are. The third game, uh, which I just recently beat, is halfway voice acted because originally first and second Cold Steel games, uh, they were like halfway voice acted and then they went through and added more voice acting to the games. So, and you can actually play it in Japanese too if you want to. You know, it's all Japanese voice acting if you want to. It's there. I confirm the delivery. But the English voices Thank are actually pretty good. You really saved me. It's up to you. You can switch back and forth. Your medicine is very popular. I am confusing him. I know. There's a lot of games. <laughs> he won't be getting those for a while anyway. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I figured he probably a lot would like really? Trolls of Cold Steel <laughs> one so more than the others because I don't know if you know his tastes at all. Before I forget, let me give you the money along with this. Oh, thank you so much. I'm sure she'll be happy too. Today is the day, right? What is Did Aisha have a crush on this guy or something? Well, I've gotta get going now. Alisa, yeah. Say hi to Neil for me. He thinks he likes Alisa. Just wait. <laughs> she's <laughs> you, like the way she looks is she's got a really nice design, but just everything else oh, about her, I'm just like, thing. nah, I'm good. I think the ruin already had a visitor today. There's the kid in there. He's not from around here. He said something about investigating the ruin. Oh, 
a visitor? It's rare for someone to come to a remote place like this. Noted, herb garden, synthesized medicine, clear. Help has been added. My help has been added. Okay. I got Neil to fever candy from Ernie. I want to go give the herb. Uh, okay. So I can actually give. Oh. I can make this then. Oh, I'm one away. Pulp paper, let's do it. Oh god, whoa, 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 whoa. She's Cinderella and she's blonde and has a nice chest. <laughs> what if I told you there was a much better character that had a bigger chest than her? Yeah, Shane, what are your thoughts on incest? Is this okay? Is this okay? Yay! Ain't got no problem with it? Good. Level up. I don't know if I should be putting it in the basket or the container, actually. Yeah, I probably should be putting it in the... Well, let's see. What are these? HP... Oh, I could probably use... Do I equip these on her? Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, I can't. It's all over here in advanced equipment, right? Nope. No. Oh, is this? Oh, I know it. Okay. <laughs> no, he's going to love Cold Steel as well. <laughs> you can tell Joshua's head over heels for Estelle. Ha! <laughs> Okay, I don't know if we're putting these things in the basket or not, I assume. I guess I could just, like, maybe in battle, you'll see. I guess we'll see in battle. How do I save? Oh, I can save the game now. Good. They have the same deck. No, they don't. No, they don't. They just happen to grow up together. It's like, just pretend they're, like, an orphan edge or something. It's fine. It, like, you know? I don't know. Falcom loves incest. They call him dad. Yeah, so what? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, should I be doing the, uh, the... What the fuck am I doing again? Uh, I can't do any of this stuff yet, so... Use... Oh, I can use it five... I have to use it five times. Okay. There are two manner, two modes of travel on the world map: standard mode and direct mode. Uh, specify your path. It helps adjust your number of travels. Uh, okay, in direct mode, it'll take the shortest number of travel days. Okay, with either mode, press B while traveling to discontinue. If you travel randomly, your days will pass quickly, so be careful. Okay. Whoa. New area discovered. Oh, I can save out here too. Okay, good. Oh, nope. nope. I always like to double check. I think Estelle likes Joshua, but she does not show up, but not sure yet. Just wait. <laughs> it, it might happen, it may not. I don't know. Boy. Arrival date. Okay. One days. One days, not day. Days. Hey, King Manny! Built by human hands, and eventually abandoned, or it is now Gudra. a paradise. How you doing? The plants, despite the course of human history, continued to expand their hold on this place. Of course, now is no different. Oh shoot! Oh, we're going. Okay. Whoa! Look at this. Oh my God! Look at that texture, though. 
Like, uh, where's it at? All right, there it is. Yeah, Rise is a good game. Um, this is an older game in the series, by the way. As soon as you get Japanese voices, you're changing over. Yeah, uh, did you know that they actually have the first and second, well, all the games. Um, first chapter, second chapter, the third chapter of uh, Trails in the Sky, plus um, the two unlocalized games that we don't have yet, but we we all played, really. Me, Rosha, and Momo have all played. Uh, those uh, have evolution like games which are an updated version of the games you're currently playing that has all it's all the entire thing is voice acted the entire game is um but we don't that's not localized so there is probably a way you can mod it in so you can have all japanese voice acting so but yeah you can probably mod in the game you're currently playing with japanese voice acting from the evolution games i don't know it's i have never done it but Play Cold Steel next after three. Yeah, don't worry about Crossbell. The after you get done playing the three Sky games, if you're still into the series, go ahead and play Cold Steel. Um, because Crossbell is kind of a hard game to play because you have to basically play it illegally. <laughs> it's up to you. I mean, if that's what you want to do. Where's it? Is there anything to do out here? Or might just run it up. I don't know. You like to play it in order? Okay. Oh, what's over here? Is it on Steam? Yeah, it's on, um, yeah, it's all on Steam. The problem is Crossbell, those Crossbell games that are not localized yet, uh, are not on Steam. So you have to, like, find it illegally. We, basically, you have to download a, on a certain website, uh, you download the Japanese version, and then you have to, um, download an English patch for it and bring it over and all that stuff, so... I mean, I played Cold Steel, and then I went back and played um, Crossbell, which a lot of us did, because back in the day, Crossbell didn't have a localization, uh, a, a fan translation, so we had to play it, you know, afterwards, and it, it turned out fine, you know, you can do whatever you want. If you want to go ahead and play Crossbell, see, the thing is about Crossbell, um, which you probably have, you don't have no idea what to talk about when I mention Crossbell, the two lo unlocalized Crossbell games actually use the same engine as the Sky games, but... The Cold Steel games actually use a brand new 3D engine, you know, like I was playing the other day. So, it's going to look a little bit weird if you play Gold Steel and then go back to Crossbell and it's going to be back to the chibi graphics again. It's up to you, whatever you want to do. You know, it doesn't really matter. You can play Cold Steel after those three or you can go play Crossbell. What? Is there anything up here? It's just a, nothing. There's nothing here. I can't go up forward. Okay, I guess we're going back. <laughs> I'm about up here. No? Whee! <laughs> Jeez. There was a way up here. This was a weird... Am I going to go to the world map again? Or is this actually going in somewhere else? Oh, no, I'm not. Okay. This music is, like, way too epic for what's going on right now. <laughs> It's like, where's all the enemies at? I figured there'd be some fighting or something. Oh yeah, second chapter will go on sale. It goes on sale all the time. I think there's any chance that the earlier trails games getting ported to the Switch, like the earlier day with the Dust Trilogy. It's up to Xseed. Like Xseed has the rights to it, so it's up to them if they want to bring Good it over. Morning. I think it's so weird that <laughs> Trails of Cold Steel 3 is the first Trails game to come to Nintendo system. Just, I know, only because uh, NIS America is the people doing it. I don't think it's going to happen. It's possible. XC could be like, yeah, sure, let's do it. You know? It looks like I can't do anything It would make a lot. I don't think it would make a ton of money for them, but I think it would, like, really help out the fan base. You know? I'd buy it just Look, to support it. It's so pretty, just like that day. You liked these flowers, didn't you, Neil? Since you disappeared, it's been two, um, three years as of today. Man, the, Erica Harlicher's voice back in the day is so bizarre. I've been working hard to keep the workshop going. <laughs> oh, she's talking Aren't to her dead. Oh. Oh, right. I brought a souvenir for you today. It's from Ernie. You liked this candy, right? Oh, and Ernie 
Jimmy told me to tell you that he says hi. We need to thank him next time. Yeah, uh, that was a little weird, actually. They they announced Cold Steel 4 for Switch before 3 is even out. <laughs> That's so bizarre. I actually didn't realize that. this room to gather medicinal herbs. I had everyone in town out looking for you. But all we found was your herb basket. Everyone said that you were spirited away. But I'm still not convinced. I've heard that these ruins sometimes swallow people up whole. But why'd it have to happen to you? Why did I ask you to help me gather medicinal herbs? So, where do you go? Neil. <laughs> wow. I don't know how I feel about her voice. It's okay. I've heard worse. Well, Panna, let's go home. I just I have laundry to do. <laughs> yeah, it's so weird. I don't know why they did that. I mean, it makes they should have waited. I feel like a little bit longer till Cold Steel Three was out on Switch. Be like, all right, guys, you like what you're playing? We'll get ready for the next one. It's like, hey, guys, you want to play the fourth one before the third one comes out? You know, here's the fourth game. If you want to, you know, get ready for it before you play the third game. It's just weird. I'll be back. Neo. Well, isn't okay. The third game. Do we know when it's coming out for Switch? It's in June, I think. So the fourth game is coming out, I assume. Oh no, no, wait, wait a minute. The fourth game isn't coming out until 2021, I think, on Switch, right? So I thought it said Nico for a second. 6:30. Okay, yeah, yeah. <gasps> uh oh. This? Huh? Oh, it's her sister. Oh, okay. I missed that. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, hello. Wait a minute. I, who is that voice actor? Neo? This isn't a dream. Oh my god, it's Kira Buckland. It? Neo! It's 2B. Where have you been this whole time? It's Chloe! <laughs> oh, she's gone. You heard like one word from her, she's gone. She peaced out. She disappeared. Neil? Where are you? She's spirited away. Hey, Ansem, what's up? Stupid! What is that thing? It's moving like a cow. I don't understand what that thing is. Why is it taking so long though? It couldn't have possibly been any voices line. What are you, are you talking about? Like coming to Switch, or you mean just coming out in general? Or are you talk about Cold Steel Three? Which which game are you talking about? If you talk about Cold Steel Four, then um. I think it's because of the they're not gonna have the game ready until a certain amount of time later and then they have to it's gonna take extra time to port it as well and maybe they want people to double dip I don't know you know get both versions no trace of it left. yeah co oh, cold still three on switch oh okay okay um they probably have a release schedule of like hey this game is coming they don't want to have too many of the releases together which you know makes sense but at the same time um, the port's probably just not ready. They have to like make sure to, you know, find the bugs and all that stuff for it. You know, the the Switch version, what the demo I played is, it was okay, it wasn't amazing, but it was playable. This was too easy. But then again, the glowing flower and a glowing body, it's easy to make an educated guess. Submit. Uh, By the way, that guy's handsome. <laughs> it's great. What is it? As you can see, I'm very busy, so please don't talk to me. Um, but that's actually a grave. It's my little sister's. So please be gentle with it. Please be gentle with my sister's grave, Mr. Ansem, sir. Was a girl from moments before? I yes. So you could see her too? Yes, parts of it. 
Your voice travels a vast distance. So, I just followed your voice. I didn't mean to intrude. Your sister seems to be in quite a predicament. To be living in such a state. This is the first time I've seen anything like that. Living? Does that mean that Neo is... safe? Is there any way to help her? Oh, and who are you? Who knows? I'm not obligated to tell you anything. Have a one Charles game a quarter? Yeah. Besides, I assume that you're the owner of that workshop, am I right? In that case, shouldn't you? Well, it came out for PC not too long solution? ago, so they're probably like, all right, let's let's stagger the releases a little bit for this PC version and then the Switch version, and then we'll have Cold Steel Four coming out in the in the fall, and then we'll have Col or Cold Steel Three out in what was it? Yeah, Cold Steel Four out in the fall, and then Cold Steel Four on Switch out next year, and then PC is probably gonna be staggered too. I mean, I don't know. How do you know about the workshop? And I don't have any solutions. And then we'll have um. How do you, how is it pronounced? Hayata? I don't know. I forgot. No, oh yeah, the 18th all. for Danganronpa news. I'm alchemist? so excited for nothing. And I want a slice alchemist? of voice anime. That's all I want. Slice What's of life that? anime. Let's go. Hajimari. There it is. Well, I'm Hajimari. I make medicine at my workshop. I'm sorry for asking. So many oh man, I once. would lose my mind for Danganronpa before. Please. But it's Please not gonna happen because Kadok or Kadok is gone, so they would have to get a new person to do Dragon Ropa, and I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> it's a switchboard's probably gonna happen. Yeah, I don't know why it hasn't happened yet. He's smoking a cigarette. He's Listen, smoking a cigarette right next to her like grave. That's philosophy. um. Truths are that's not something, something that, <laughs> that I didn't expect. You yourself must demand and grasp them. If you want to know the truth. Then you must study and think on like I love Dung and Ropa to death, but like playing it again is really hard because you know everything that's gonna happen and it's kinda hard to stick with it. Because you just know what everything about it. It's just like sometimes you play the games for the gameplay and you know Dung and Ropa doesn't have the most amazing gameplay in the world. It's about, you know, the story and its characters and I don't know. Yes. However, it's not something Unless Kadaka has finished a death into. march. But didn't he didn't he leave Chi uh, Spike Tune stuff altogether though? Or he did he leave like temporarily? I'm pretty sure he left altogether. Advice, though I have no obligation to do so. Take it as my apology for intruding. First, as a means to finding your sister, you must study alchemy. So what is alchemy? How do I? You just did it, Aisha. You just did it back there. We did some, remember? <laughs> and second, this glowing flower, you must understand it. That is all. Your sister Whoops. is somewhere you can't reach with your hands. <laughs> Giggity. With alchemy, there are a number of different ways to bring her back. This glowing flower? It doesn't look like a medicinal herb. What is it exactly? Don't ask me. Answer that question on your own. Well, farewell. Bye. And some... Please wait. Zimnus. I have a few more questions. She herself doesn't seem to be aware of it. But I didn't expect to encounter alchemy in a place like this. However, that girl, in her current state, I'd say she has about three years. Uh oh. I kind of like how the cuts. Remember the cutscenes in Ryza? Um, let me see if I can find it really quick. Every cutscene in Ryza had those black bars and annoyed the crap out of me. Yeah, like right here. Every one of them has these black bars and supposed to make it more cinematic. I hate it. I hate it so freaking much. It's just. It's, ugh. And then you have regular non voice cutscenes that look like this. You know, I like these. I wish every cutscene was like this. Ugh. Neo, glowing flowers. Like this is great. I wish they would go back to this style. I wonder if I can really. I guess maybe the other way it helps them like less animation or something. Have to deal. I don't know. It blocks some stuff out. I know. I should write it all down in a diary and organize everything. But first, I need to compose myself. You need to compose yourself, Aisha. Um, 
Oh, Despair so Girls nice. 2, me featuring Maki and Himiko. Yes. Oh my god. You know, I remember a, year, a few years ago, me, Rosha, and um, Momo, we were talking about... I think Shane was there too. We were talking about, um, like, a new Dying Robot title, like, after V3, like, what would it be in it, you know? Despair Girls, the next Despair Girls would be it. And then, like, we'd have to go rescue Shuichi or something. Like, it's not gonna happen, obviously. Kawaita Shoujo? Yeah. The memory system allows Aisha to write her experiences into her diary and receive various benefits for it, okay? You use points to write in the diary. Writing entries can reward you with appropriate bonuses. Entries in game added can be taken various action in the game or spending time with other characters. You points in various ways. Try as many things to leave more memories. For further information, please check the help section in the library, okay? Um, Neo was there. Neo, Neo was there. Spectate, spec, spectalid. What the heck, spectalid, spectalid. What the fuck is that? I, I can't read. I'm dyslexic. Okay. <laughs> Need alchemy star journey. Spectalid. I don't know. I, I can't read. Uh, we get HP up. Oh shit. Uh, that is not what I meant to do. We did it! I went to the Arab Garden as usual. When Neo suddenly appeared, she was exactly the same as back then. However, she soon disappeared. It seemed like there was nothing. Okay, it was a spirit and illusion. That was definitely the real Neo. I know it. This is already way more intriguing than Ryza's story. Like, it really is. Ryza's story is very chill. It's a very chill story about just being going off on an adventure in the summer. That's all it is. Um... I met a, yeah, I met a man. A, a word that I can't say. <laughs> I think Rumpa is done. I do think Rumpa is done, too. I really think Dying Rumpa is finished. What they're going to do now is a bunch of side stuff. But if they do decide to do another game, I wouldn't complain. Okay, I've decided. Ryza has no big bad. Nope. Uh, these games aren't really about a big Please bad guy or anything. It's not really a typical JRPG. It's all about creating stuff. It's about alchemy, uh, bonding with characters. It's not really about, like, oh, we're going on for this giant adventure to go defeat the big bad guy that is trying to destroy the world or anything like that. I mean, Ryza kind of has a little bit of that um, towards the end, but it comes out of nowhere. And it's just like, all right, there's this giant entity that's going to destroy our island if we don't go out and do this that's it i mean it, it's not even a big thing it's kind of like a last minute thing that happens i wonder if this note is okay yeah I'm most sure of the I, I think there's a few um there's a few atlier games that kind of do that but it's not ever a main focus these games are just kind of chill relaxing now i just need some ointment like, right now, this is already way more intriguing than Ryza's story. <laughs> Ryza's a good game. I love Ryza to death, but it's like, it's just a very chill, like, alright, uh, we're gonna go off into this part of the world. Okay, we're gonna go here now. Uh, we're gonna meet this character. Oh, we're gonna learn about this kind of alchemy or something. And then there's, like, some lore behind the island that you're on and stuff. But it never goes anything, like, big, like a big JRPG does. Neo is somewhere I can't reach with my hands, but she's still alive. I don't know how much of what that Slice of Life, the game, essentially. Yeah, yeah, that's what these games are mostly about. At least the ones I played. Um, the other one I played is Atelier Sophie, uh, which I, I enjoyed that too. I liked Ryza a lot more. Like, Ryza does a lot of things really well. With the, like, I like the world that it's in. Uh, I like the alchemy system a lot. I like the characters, mostly. You know, some of them are kind of eh. I like Ryza. A lot of people don't like Ryza, surprisingly. A lot of people that have played the game, I've went around and looked at people's reactions to her, and a lot of people don't like her personality because she's just an, a brat, and you know, that's that's fine with me. She's a nice change of pace because a lot of these characters in the Atlier series are a lot of the same, very like, ah, the, I'm a goody girl, you know? I'm just, uh, I'm gonna go off and, you know, help the world do this, and Ryza's just like, <laughs> she's not like that, like at all. 
I should believe it all for now. First things first. I mean, I've only played like three Outlier games out of the 20 games that there is, so I can't really say a whole lot. <laughs> There's 21 games now, that's crazy. But what should I do after that? I've never traveled before. What in the hell are you? Yeah, for <laughs> some floor, I? <gasps> did I save that clip? I think I did. I gotta find it really quick. It's like the best scene in the game. Oh, by the way, the switch port of Ryza is is really good, actually. Uh, oh, is this it? Yeah, this is it. I was gonna show you this real quick. It's funny. It's just... It just out of freaking nowhere, she blows like half the town up. It's like, what? And it, it came from nowhere. It's like, what the hell was that? She, I, I, I don't understand. I didn't understand at the time. What was she trying to do? She was trying to like, I don't know. I still don't get it. <laughs> She's like, it's got <laughs> I'm like, okay. Okay, that thing's yeah, really yeah. annoying. I'll figure out the later things later. The later things later. Great line. There are so many things I don't understand. But I have to get started. Neil, your big sister definitely will save you. So Oh shoot. So wait for okay, me. Hannah, let's go. Oink, Neil. Oh, are we actually traveling? Oh, okay. That's different. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, is this the opening? I got really loud all of a sudden. I'll turn that down a little bit. Ooh, Atelier Ice Show, here we go. Ooh, this is a much better song than before. This game has two anime openings, or two, like, songs, I guess, because this really isn't. <laughs> Pause for a few seconds, come back to run, yeah, rise up, make your shit go boom. Yeah. It's like the only scene in the game that made no sense, really. It was just all of a sudden she decided, I'm gonna blow part of the town up. I forget what the reason was. Ooh, I like this. I hear one of the best Atelier games is the game right after this one in the trilogy. I don't know how loud- this is really loud for me by the way, so... I turned it down on the stream so hopefully it's okay. There, Aisha, the Alchemist of Dusk. That's a... I didn't expect that to happen. Because we already had the anime opening. So this, this game has two openings. That's crazy. This game did have the budget. Yeah, uh, Rise's battle system is completely different. Every other Atelier game in the series, as far as I'm aware, is turn-based. Rise's is more like an ATB. Kind of like, you know... Um, if you ever play Final Fantasy 8 or 9, it's kind of like that. Um, a little bit. Let's see, did I save any clips of battling? Let me see, I can actually turn this back up now. I get to show you really quick. I don't know if I saved any clips for battling, but... Uh, oh, here we go. It's on the left side there. Well, my camera's blocking me. Yeah. Your, your turns show up at the bottom there. 
You're, you're always doing something most of the time. When your when your portrait reaches that circle down there, your turn happens. Stream FF <laughs> remake. I almost thought about doing it today. I might do it. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that in a little bit. I'm on chapter 11. I got to the uh, the ghost train. Yeah. yeah, it's it's a lot more ATB like. Old school Final Fantasy. Um, this is completely turn based, so. Alright, where should I go? A village created along a ruin. I don't know, do you guys want to see Final Fantasy 7 remake instead? Because I'm actually, I feel like playing that right now, actually. I made it to the, um,. The Ghost Train Graveyard, I believe. I... Kind of reminds me of Xenoblade 1. So was about to say, eh, kinda. It's not really. What have you done? I don't know. I just. I don't know. I was going to play more of it later tonight um, when I was done streaming, but I, I might do it now. I don't know. Aisha's Remote Medicine Workshop. Okay. I want to get it to at least one battle in, the, in this. Oh, we're already going to a village. Because I haven't even done a single battle in this game yet. It takes three days to... Oh. I just want to see if the combat... I think the combat is pretty much like every other Atelier game that's before Ryza. A lot of people actually didn't like Ryza's battle system. I actually really liked it. It's, it's a lot different. It's a cute little thing that I'm gonna beat up. What do I do? I think I entered their territory. Sorry, I'll just be leaving now. Oh, it's a cute little bat thing. You're trying to avoid spoilers, stick only Okay, no, it's fine. I, I won't do it. Enemies wander freely around the field map, press Y to strike them with your staff and take the initiative. Okay, so it's like alright, got it. Good for them, they're wrong. <laughs> During battle one gets KO. Yeah, see, this is it's literally just a turn based battle system. It's very basic. Yeah, it's you get your turn, okay. Uh, oh, it turns your okay, so it's kinda Yeah, okay. You see your turn coming up on the right. Some actions may generate bonuses depending on where you're at. Okay, you can earn XP, level leveling up. Got it. Alright. Enemies near towns aren't that strong. As you reach more remote regions, stronger enemies will appear. Those enemies are formidable and won't be easy to defeat. And to avoid wasting time and having your character get KO'd, prepare attack and healing items when you travel for it. Okay. Yeah, I don't think he's gonna let me hey, yeah. go. I need to protect myself. I'll keep calm and do my best. Okay, I have all these items. Now, I think in this game, your items... In Ryza, from what I understand, uh, all the items... Uh, you have a... You, once you make it, you get to keep it. And you have, like, limited uses on them. And it's kind of like MP, where... Uh, you get to use it, and then it just stays in your inventory. In this game, I think once you use it, it's gone. We could test it. Let's go ahead and test it. Uh, we have... S How many do we have? Two, four, six... We have six of these things, so... Oh, hey, that's a healing item. <laughs> yep, it does. Okay, well, that's good. <laughs> I didn't realize what it did. I it was like I'm throwing an attack item on the enemy. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, it actually does damage to him, too? Okay, let's do an attack then. Oh, he's gone. Well, he didn't really win. We just kind of ran away. Wow. Oh, 
Oh, I have to hold it down. Attack item, so many options. Yeah, I know, right? I guess we get magic later. Muddy water and thin fruit. Yep, I think I've got enough. Maybe I should start heading back. Oh yeah, you can only carry this much now. Oh, that sucks. So much. World map, okay. Where should I go? Uh, go back. Wow, man, you, we are not getting far at all. What should I okay, so I can make this now. Property, fix slight wound. Uh, how do I look at the... How do I look? Oh, here we go. Increases HP restoration when earth element items used into its effect. Okay. Um, there's that. Alright. Okay? Sure. Make one. Yeah, it's it's a very basic um, battling system, and I just realized I think even the items I create go to my basket, which takes up my space to gather more stuff. I don't know how I feel about that. That is, um, not enough ingredients. Okay, man, this is a very basic alchemy system compared to like Rice's. Like, this is just like, you take items, you put them in, you make it. <laughs> Before, it was like a puzzle game. Okay. Now, okay, my basket. Oh my god. Wait. Or am I looking at... No, I'm looking at my basket. How do I give up my stuff? I don't want the stuff in a basket. Oh, I think I may have just like, no, I don't want this. I want to keep it or something. I'll go back out and we'll come back in and see what happens. Oh, run. Oh my god, there's a run button. What? Yeah, it's... Uh, let me go back in. I just want to make sure... Uh... Because I still have stuff in my basket, right? Hold on. Yeah, I still have all this in my basket. I don't want that because that's taking up all of my space. What? No, get out of my basket. <laughs> I only have six spaces to get stuff? Are you serious? Oh, to get Oh, okay. Well, there was. I thought I could took all this back to my container. There. That's weird. Okay. So my destination is there, but I ran into uh, a problem last time. Let's see, I can actually... They said I could push, like, Y or something? Wait, dressing room. Hold on, what? Oh my god. Oh my god. Because of, oh, my webcam is off. I forgot about that. What the hell? Passion cloth? Oh my god. No, I'm good. Fairy headband? Oh. Yep. Flower crown, flower band. Hey, that looks pretty cool. Yep. Look. Oh. All right. 
and then uh, okay I don't have anything for accessory facial I don't have anything for my facials okay okay got it before dusk settled over the world no one even thinks about the vestiges of a land once brimming with water even so people cling to this land vigorously living out their lives Whoa, what the heck? I got like 13 notifications on Facebook once, over to Facebook, Twitter, one second. Oh, uh, Manny, you're talking to somebody, okay. <laughs> I was like, hey, wait a minute. Hey, Aisha, long time no see. Hey, that voice actor, I know you. Oh my God, it's her, it's um, it's Wendy Lee, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, is that her? Yeah, that's her. Regina! Yeah, it's been a while. You've been all confined to your workshop lately. What's up? It's Fuka! And in Persona 4 uh, Dancing All Night, she's Fuka. <laughs> I've been thinking things over, and I It's me you! It's freaking me you! What? In Akane? With everything that happened with Neo, I was worried. It is Miyu. I recognize her now. It's freaking Miyu. Where are you going on your journey? I haven't decided yet, so my destination is uncertain. Mm -hmm. Then where are you going to stay? Fuka is Persona. I know she's in Persona 3. I just that's why I was like, it's Fuka. Oh, Persona 3. Hold on. Pers oh, Persona 3, Dancing Moonlight. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, I thought I said Persona 4. My bad. I don't know. I don't remember her. I don't remember Persona 4 characters hardly. Still need to figure that out. Yep, she's Miyu. She's Danganronpa's Miyu. Heck yeah. That's awesome. I didn't. I knew I recognized her a little bit. Going on a journey without knowing your destination? You sure are doing something daring. Hey, if you don't have a place to stay, come to my house. It's also Clover you. from Zero Escape. Hell yeah. I want to know more about your journey. I'm tied up right now with my job. And it's Bulma. For Dragon Ball. The door unlocked, so invite yourself inside hey, she's a, Athena out. Sykes from Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Spirit of Justice. I never played that, but it's there. Oh, do you remember where my place is? Oh, she's Blanc from Neptunia as well. Yeah, I think I remember. That's about it, really. I guess you won't get lost in a small village like this. Yeah, when she's a foul okay, that's what she sounds later. like. Yeah, Wendy D Wendy Lee does a ton. She's gonna become a party member. I'm pretty sure. There's actual towns in this game. That's Oh. Okay, there's one little tiny area here. Warehouse? Where did I put it? I need to make a habit of taking things out of the container before I forget. Oh, memory point for that. Okay. House. I haven't found a material. Dried root. Okay. So that goes to my basket, right? Okay, it does. Good. That's what I thought. Two container. Wait, I can just take everything to my container? What? Or, oh, it's probably because I'm in a town, I imagine. Just a little bit. Thoughts on AI and the Sonian files? One of the best games of 2019. Actually, it is probably my favorite game of 2019. 
I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's right. Even better than... I don't know if it's... It's Kingdom Hearts 3 year, though, so, you know. It's... It's probably my favorite game of 2019. I loved it so much. Mr. Glide, I've been telling you that I won't get in the way of your work. It, it gives me those Danganronpa feels, you know, where it was like a part of my soul was missing when I beat those games or when I finished those games. And AI the Somni Files brought that back, that sort of mystery vibe. All I'm saying is that I want to get a little peek at the ruin. You just don't understand, do you? It's dangerous in there, so I can't let you in. This guy is another voice actor I know. Children need to stay out. Oh my god, who is that, guys? Who is that? Being a woman has nothing to do with this. Excuse me for raising my voice. Besides, I saw a girl go in there a few moments ago. Oh god, I, there's so many voices that I just know. They're, it's like they're so well known. Tina? She's like a guy. She may not look like it, but she's a seasoned prospector. He's got a little bit more of a, a rasp in his voice. Train your body and become a prospector. What would a missy like you want with this ruin in the first place? She, she seems pretty forceful. Oh, it's Sojiro. Yeah, it is. It's Sojiro. What's up, Daddy? So Jiro from Persona 5. I oh, want also her, that girl. Um, let's see. She is Michelle Ruff. Wait, I know her. Oh, she's Kawakami. Yeah. What's up with this cow? <laughs> Kawakami and Sojiro talking to each other. Love it. Oh, my headset is dying. Any second now. I'm gonna take a nice Shit. long look around the inside of this ruin next time. It might last another minute or two. I, I hear when it cuts out like that no towards the end, that means it's gonna die in a second. Back. You better believe it. To argue with yep. If it happens every time I'm about to stream, I'm like, I should probably, you know, charge my headset before I do this. <laughs> and once that happens, I'm screwed on Switch at least. I can play on PS4 still, but when I'm on Switch, I can't use another headset. It just won't work. Get that water. Rain his house. <gasps> Anyway, it's been quite a while. Like, almost a year? Probably. It's been around that long since you came to visit me. And so why are you going on this journey? Peddling medicine? How can I say this? I'm looking for rare flowers. Rare flowers? Are you gonna use them to synthesize medicine? No. Oh, a Monokuma reference to the... I just now read your message, Fanny. Um, oh, it keeps randomly buffering? One second. Is it me? Maybe it might... No. Oh, I've had a 0.3 drop frames. Um, that might be me. I'm not sure. I heard that they could be clues to finding Neo. Neo. Sometimes if I'm like put too many, um, too much internets in my stream, it just decides to like, it, it's like, no, nah, Twitch can't handle this or something. But Neo was, you know, spirited away and this person told me that Neo 
is still alive somewhere. If she is alive, I think I can do something to see her again. It may sound impossible, but it's something I have to believe in. Hmm. So you decided to believe that person? Then I'm in no position to fault you for it. Okay, then. I'll help you. <laughs> Thank you very much. I know this kind of story is hard to believe, but... Just you saying that makes me happy. Hmm. So, the clues that will help me find Neo are these glowing flowers. Glowing flowers? Being spirited away and flowers seem to have nothing to do with each other. I'm not sure about the details, but if I investigate the flowers, he said I, I feel can feel like it's the second Neo. in the trilogy. Um, this is the first in the three. There's three games in this trilogy. Um, in the Dusk trilogy, every Atelier game has its own, you know, sub-series. So, uh, this is the first in the Dusk trilogy. So these are all new characters and everything. As far as I'm aware. <laughs> oh, but I think I know someone who might know about them. I really want to rise to have a dub. Really? I really did. I'm so mad I didn't get yeah. one. There's a person who lives in Fierzeburg, a town to the north. He who who do you think would be a good Ryza? Collects various items as a hobby. As a patron of rare things, he might know something about rare flowers. Rosha, you only beat the first Ryza. You can't wait for Ryza two and three. What do you want more thickness? Is that what it is? Um, could you please introduce me to him? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Well, the thing is, I was gonna go the, to here's the thing that a lot of people aren't getting. Anyway. Ryza won't be the main character in the next game. She'll probably be in the game in some way, but she won't be the main character. That's the thing about the these games is that this character, the main character, they only become the main character for one of the games, but they're in the next games, so they're more of a side character. So we're gonna have a new main character in whatever the new uh, sub-series is actually called. Um, it might be like Secret Hideout or something, or Darkness or something, I don't know. They always keep like something in the title for the next couple games. If that's our plan, I'll hurry and get ready for the journey. You're right. And even then, we might not even get an, the Ryza, a next game for Ryza. Like, it may be another... Because sometimes they like to do that, like... Uh, they went back and actually did a uh, a game for an older sub-series. And then they went ahead and did Ryza afterwards. Like, even though Ryza was technically next, it's, it's weird. They, the Koei Tecmo is weird. <laughs> That reminds me, Aisha. Didn't you bring too much stuff with you? You look more like you're moving away than going on a journey. <laughs> and this is after I tried cutting back on the luggage. I've never been on a journey before. Why don't you leave the things you won't need here? Huh? At your house? But... Are you sure? Yeah, I have plenty of space anyway. So feel free to use it like your own house. Thank you very much. Then <coughs> I'll take advantage of your kind offer. Oh yeah, they're doing the fight fairy tale game too. Yeah. I'll just put my cauldron down here. Which they delay, which is interesting. I didn't expect them to delay that kind of game. I didn't think they cared about quality for fairy tale what? game, <laughs> considering the series, you know. You need that on your journey. Huh? <laughs> really? But I start to get restless without my Battle laundry. Network is has to happen. Battle Network needs no, to happen. No, no. It's not like a pillow or anything. Normal people don't carry these around. Just leave it here. Hannah must have had a tough time. Okay, I'll do that. I'm happy I'll get to synthesize at your house. <laughs> you sure do like to synthesize. Anyway, I'll be looking forward to spending time with you, Aisha. Okay. You can now use Regina's house. Regina can now join your party. Nice. You can now synthesize container system menu journal from Regina. Oh, I was already doing the town though, so okay. More places you can... Oh. Okay. Oh. <gasps> A character can join your party has been added. Recruit barbers can go with Aisha on her journey. These friends can join you in battle and help you gather. You can make a, take a maximum of two friends. Okay. 
it's like uh, okay easy easy peasy two container yes uh, oh it only takes I see a reliable big sister neat 